Coming with Ghost. We're here to do a pick a card reading. As you guys know, you have pile one, pile two, and pile three. If you hear Philly in the background, it's well because he shoved right up my butt. Um, if you guys have been following me on social media, you guys know that uh, recently we lost Oreo. So that's been kind of rough and I've kind of been in a funk, if you will. So without further ado, we're gonna get started. If you guys need to pause this video to meditate and uh, pick your pile that way, go right ahead. Um, this is going to be basically what we need to know going forward. As you guys know, Valentine's Day is coming up. So everybody always has mixed emotions about that. And uh, so yeah, let's see, moving forward. So we're gonna start off with pile one. So if you picked that, let's get into it. I'm gonna move these over to the side. We have Rose Quartz, all right, for your guys' crystal card. Um, Rose Quartz is a lot about self-love, self-worth. Um, it's, you know, I, I personally use Rose Quartz a lot if I'm feeling down, need a little pick-me-up. You guys also have the Two of Coins. Interesting. By the way, I'm using the Disney deck. It's um, the Villains deck, so here's the Two of Coins. You also have the Six of Wands, interesting. So with the Two of Coins, this is all about weighing options, right? So it's interesting that you have the Rose Quartz, self-love, self-worth, but then you have the Two of Coins come out, choices, you're weighing your options on what is going on with your life. Maybe you're considering a job um, or friends, anything really. With the Six of Wands coming in, this is whatever choice you're going to make, you're going to be successful in. So maybe you're overthinking uh, the choice that you want to make. You also have the Three of Coins here. Interesting. Pretty sure these are the Hyenas. Um, you have the Three of Coins here. This is, you know, like a collaboration, teamwork. So this could be moving, you know, with your job. Maybe you're thinking about getting a new job or you're offered a promotion or maybe you want to go for you know, management or something like that in your job field. You also have the Empress here, okay? This is all about creation. It could also mean fertility as well. Uh, maybe you're trying to get pregnant or you're thinking about it or you're worried about it. That could also come into play here. Uh, maybe you're worried about the money situation, the financial situation. If you are pregnant and you're freaking out about that, um, that could also come into play. But this is... This is also, you know, about abundance as well, okay? Creation, abundance. So for group one with you guys, you have, I feel this urge of like, you feel like you're not good enough and you're stuck in the rut and I don't know, it's like you're holding yourself back. So maybe you don't feel like you're good enough and you don't, you know, want to push yourself um, to your dreams and your goals in this situation. Honestly, it's yourself that's, that's holding you back. Okay, that's kind of where I'm at with this. I just, for me, it's almost like maybe you need to talk with, you know, a friend or a colleague or, you know, whomever. Like, you might be hanging out with the wrong people, you know, and they're putting you down. And maybe you should change, you know, your scenery when it comes to people as well. So you can move forward and you can progress and you can, you know, have that work out for you. You know, I feel like... A lot is weighing on financially just because of the coins that are coming out here. A lot is weighing on you financially, guys. So with that being said, on group one, that's where we're at with that. Um, if you guys don't know, I do these pretty quickly. Personally, I don't uh, really last too long on longer videos. All right, the next group here. Let's see what you guys have. All right, the crystal you guys have is Auralite. I believe that's how you pronounce it. Don't come for me in the comments if it's wrong. I'm doing my best here. But this crystal is all about meditation, right? It's meditation to the present. So maybe some of you guys are living in the past, right? You can't let it go. Or maybe you're too much in the future and you're trying to plan ahead and you want this and you want that. That's what I get from this right here, okay? Uh, let's see here. You have the Four of Swords. Interesting. So this is rest and recovery card, right? This is like you're exhausted. Look, 
you're exhausted on this. So you're either thinking too much in the past, all right, or you're too far in the future. You're not in the present and you're totally exhausting yourself. What are you guys thinking about? Interesting. Knight of Cups. Would you look at that? Knight of Cups. Romance. Maybe because Valentine's Day is coming up. You're thinking all about that romance. You want that buff guy, that good looking guy. You want, you know, please. So you guys are overthinking too much. Uh, Jesus, you also have the Knight of Coins, all right? So the Knight of Coins, this is reliable person. This is a hardworking person. Maybe you are wearing yourself out because you're working too hard. You're just doing, doing, doing for everybody, all right? Maybe you're trying to impress somebody and you're doing too much for them and it's you're thinking about the future or maybe you did too much for that person in the past maybe it's an ex and you did too much for that person in the past you keep thinking about it you got to get out of that you got to be in the present the here and the now uh the next card that comes out for you guys is the page of coins all right this is like a new job new opportunities this is you may be getting a raise at work a promotion things like that okay so while you're wanting to be in the past or be too much in the future, you have to understand that what you have, one, you can't let people just take advantage of you because it's wearing you out. That's what's happening with this. It is absolutely wearing you out. You want that raise. You want possibly a new job. And when I say new job, it doesn't have to mean that you're moving to a different job. It simply means maybe you want a different position, all right? Or you're sick of your job and you want a new one. You want to do something else. Maybe you want to do YouTube. Maybe you want to be a gamer. Maybe you want to work for yourself, okay? You have to get yourself there, but don't overdo it. Because that's what I'm getting from this. It's like... You are just kind of all over the place, whether that be with romance, whether that be with your job, whatever it may be, maybe you work with your partner and you're sick of it and you want to do your own thing. Group two, you guys are all about like, you want, 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 and you can do it, but you're doing, you're juggling too many things and it's completely exhausting you. So you guys really need to get that recovery in. You know, if you need to meditate, you meditate on that. If you need to take a bath, you take a bath on that. But you guys are completely exhausting your energy that it kind of makes me feel a little bit hard to breathe. You know, like you're just choking because you're just doing too much. You have too much on your plate. All right. So you need to focus on yourself, but do it in, you know, a more, uh, how do I want to say it? It's like you, you're going a hundred miles a minute. You need to bring it down to maybe 50 miles a minute, if that makes sense, right? So group two, you guys are exhausting. If you pick group two, you need to go meditate and relax and chill out. All right, group three. Ooh, what is this? Lemurian, Lemurian quartz. Again, don't come for me in the comments. Chill out, guys. All right, this one is... Um, about the big picture okay it's about that vision if you actually look at this card right here you see and then there's a key right in the crystal right like just turn that key that's what uh this one is about there's also a key here there's a key here and here so it's almost like portals right it's all about the big picture it's all about your vision of things oh boy we have the Three of Cups. This could be eh, friendship, celebration, um, just friends in general. Let me see what else. Gosh, more cups, huh? Eight of Cups. Ooh. You might be withdrawing from your friend circle here. Somebody might not be getting along. Or it could be family, you know. You, you're withdrawing. You're, whatever's going on, you're like over it. Interesting with the crystal, um, the quartz here, the Lemurian or Lemurian quartz. Um, you're kind of seeing the big picture here of friends or family or whomever, and you're withdrawing, or maybe they're withdrawing from you. Oh boy, four of wands. Maybe you guys have a reunion coming up, or you guys got together and you're seeing what's really going on. Ace of swords. Oh boy. Yeah, so it's going to be a blowout or it has been a blowout. This is conflict. 
This is, you have got your clarity. This is conflict. And you're thinking, what in the hell is going on with either your friends, your family? Uh, something happened. There was a get-together of some sort, or there's going to be, and you're now seeing the bigger picture. It's interesting because I almost feel like it's like a cheating scenario. As bad as that sounds, I feel like whomever you're with or were with, it's almost like they're with maybe a family member or like your best friend. It is kind of toxic, but you're going to see it and you're not going to like it. Oh, uh, with what's going on? Oh, Lordy. Man, this is like really heavy on my heart. Like I feel like a lot of tears, but it's, as bad as it is, it's like a good thing because it's like you thought that this was going on and had been going on. And then guess what? Boom. It actually is. That's the reality. And it sucks. But you will pull away from it because also with the Ace of Swords, this is like, excuse me, this is like new ideas, right? This is like, you're going to move on. You're going to move on to bigger, better things. So this has to happen in order for the new door to open for you, right? Almost like you're going to be going through a transformation. Um, and it's kind of this symbol right here, for whatever reason, that's what it's kind of reminding me of, is a transformation that's going to be coming in. You you are going to feel a bit lonely, but at the end of the day, you're better than that. You know what I'm saying? You deserve better and you are better than that. So what's going to happen is going to suck. Okay, that's the reality of it. But you will move past it and... It is what it is. So there you guys go. Um, I know that I did these pretty fast. You know, I'm trying to get back in the swing of things. It's been really rough uh, dealing, you know, with the loss of Oreo. As you guys know, that was my soul dog. So I'm going to be trying to put out more videos more often. If you guys have any ideas of what you would like for me to do, if you like the pick of cards, let me know in the comment section below. I could do more of those. Um, also, I've been considering doing more true crime. It is pretty exhausting on me, but I do enjoy doing those. So if that's something that you guys want to see more of, let me know in the comments below. I've missed you guys. Just drop by, say hi. Make sure you give this video a like. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.